just want to see if any widgeon come in. I've hammered this pond a fair bit lately, as you've probably have seen, but there's a couple of reasons I like to come down here anyway. It's right on a goose flight line, and the geese can hold very unpredictable times. They can fly through the night, and certainly after dark, they're a bit odd, the local grey lag geese. They seem to like to move about even on dark nights when there's no moon. So it's just nice to be down here on the off chance. And the number of geese I've shot just by being sat down here uh, is, um, is quite considerable. And it's a much better night, although there's not much of a sunset that I'll like to have just to see the ducks. There is a good old wind which we hadn't, which we there's a good old wind which we haven't had up to now. So yeah, just I like to test the water to see when the widgeon start to come in. Now they are on the estuary, which means there may be one or two come in. Um, I've hammered this pond quite hard on the teal and mallard, but I kind of almost have a split season on it in that um, I don't mind giving them a bit of hammer early season. And then when the widgeons start coming in, we kind of back off a bit and try and fly it mainly on the uh, on the moonlit nights when we can get the best out of it on the widgeon. So up to now there's been no widgeon to scare, uh, but a very strong gusty wind today. It's right at my back, uh, blowing out that way, southeast wind. So I assume it, anything will come in in that little bit of sky. So I might actually see something coming in tonight. Um, got the video camera set on night mode which I've never set before so it might catch a bit more than it normally does I haven't bothered with the GoPro and I doubt that the shop cam will pick anything up but so let's give it a go